Classic, the 22nd All-Star Game. Cleveland's Al Lopez and New York's Leo DeRocher match managerial wits before Commissioner Ford Frick and 45,000 other baseball fans. Robin Roberts started for the National Leaguers while pitched Harvey Keen in from third in the first inning. So it was 1-0 in favor of the junior loop. Then with two on, the senior circuit was in more hot water when Mickey Mantle teed off on Roberts. The cameraman had a hard time finding the fence, but Mickey didn't. His hit cleared the fence in deep center field for a home run. The American League was the underdog, but you'd never have known it, as Nellie Fox and Ted Williams escorted Mickey Mantle around the base paths to make it a 4 to nothing ball game. Another run in the sixth made it 5 nothing. In the eighth, the National Leaguers finally tied it up, and nodded it was till the bottom of the twelfth, when Stan Musial of the Cardinals, playing in his twelfth All-Star game, stepped in. And there's your ball game, a circuit clout by Stan the Man giving the National League its fifth All-Star victory in the last six years. One of baseball's great stars wins the All-Star game with a sudden death flourish. It's all over, but the shouting. <laughs>